When you have a rectangular rock, what better way to use it than to make a gift for the holidays? Let's get started by base coating this rock with some bright red metallic paint by Folk Art. I like this paint because it's shimmery, but it's not too overpowering and it just fits really well to coat Santorini stones. Then I'm gonna take a pencil and line out the ribbon for this gift. So first the bow, and then I'm gonna line out the ribbon going in four directions on the gift. Now I'm gonna take a Thule Art acrylic paint pen in the color green and outline all of the ribbon and fill it in. see my pen is kind of dying and it's just giving me a difficult time to the point that I eventually give up and pull out some green paint. This green paint is going to take a couple of coats because it's a lighter color and the metallic paint underneath the red metallic paint kind of has a, a sheen to it that you know lacks a little bit of grip like you would have with Liquitex gesso. So it's going to take a couple of coats, but it's a brighter green, so I think it's going to work out in the end. Told ya, look how that color pops. Now I'm coming back to the pencil and I am just lining out a small gift tag on the rock, and then I'm going to take Liquitex gesso to base coat it because of that shiny um, texture on the red paint. So I'm going to base coat it with Liquitex gesso and then white paint on top of that. Now I'm going to take my Sakura Pigma fine line brush pen and outline all of the ribbon. Now to make this ribbon pop, we're going to add some of this lighter green glitter paint to it with a fine line disposable eyeliner brush. Now we're going to put a little writing on that gift tag that says give the gift of kindness and then outline the gift tag. Even though this design works really awesome with this rock because it's shaped like a rectangle box, I think you could still pull it off with an oval rock or a round rock and it'll still look really awesome. I'm finishing off the bow with a couple of little accent lines and then some white lines to indicate kind of the shine on ribbon. If you try this design, I hope you have as much fun as I did with it. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already so you don't miss future video uploads and watch the next video in the series. As always, thank you so much for being here and I'll see you next time. Take care.